I'm Anna Rossi, grilling up a storm on the Fire Magic, and there is so much to love about this grill. But maybe one of the most show-stopping features is the rotisserie. Are you ready to have some fun? Here's what we have for the rotisserie kit. We have a 5 8 inch hex stainless steel rod with a counterbalance. We're gonna adjust this, customize to our protein once we get this loaded. Here's the high torque motor. This can turn up to 75 pounds and it plugs right into your grill. The key to a great bird is a really good brine and I love using a dry rub. It's easy to control and you can play around with some really beautiful aromatics. Using a base of kosher salt, I'm gonna fold in some toasted anise seed, a little bit of orange zest, which gives it this really unexpected citrus note, and some fresh herbs like rosemary, thyme, and oregano. And a touch of brown sugar adds sweetness and depth. It's delicious. This is a 25 pound turkey. This is gonna go in the refrigerator uncovered overnight, and then you're going to rinse it and bring it back down to stuff it and get ready for the grill. Don't worry, I have one started. The thing that I love about these turkey baskets is that you don't need to tie your bird off with butcher's twine. They have holes in the back for the legs, and I like to tuck my wings in. Okay, there she goes. Importantly, let's tighten these bolts. You wanna get in on the flat surface and this is gonna keep the basket nice and secure when it starts to spin. And then we'll line it up with the motor and then let it rest right down here in that little nook. Before I fire up the quantum back burner, I like to turn the motor on and see if I need to adjust the counterbalance. I'm watching to see if the bird's gonna flop over and it needs to be tweaked. Here I'm just adjusting the counterbalance so the bird has a really smooth, even rotation. You can adjust it back and forth and up and down here. I think this should do the, the trick. This looks pretty good. So with the hot surface ignition, I'm gonna fire up the quantum back burner. What's really cool is that back burner is made out of stainless steel foam, which has a really efficient high heat distribution. Think of this grill like an oven. So every time you lift the hood, you're gonna lose some heat. Take advantage of this magic view window. You can see the color start to build on the skin and it'll give you a sense of when it's time to do some basting. Speaking of basting, I like to keep a little infused butter on the cooking deck ready to go. This has some garlic, some herbs that I put in the bird also in here, and it just keeps it really liquid and nice. That's good to go. So grab your oven mitts and then you just pull the rotisserie out of the motor. I'd say we're ready for the table. With the Fire Magic Grill, you can have a Thanksgiving feast like this year round. For this recipe and this grill, head over to firemagicgrills.com. Mmm.